Now, I became a Christian about the age of 20. That means this was long before I started my doctorate in physical chemistry, where I studied spectroscopy. I did a bit of work on high temperature superconductors and published in the journal Nature when I was quite young. But actually, all my published work was done after I became a young Earth creationist. Now, part of the reason I became one is that I could see a disconnect between the real science I was learning in all my classes and the claims of evolution. And I've gone through some of them in this presentation here. But it just shows that you don't need to be an evolutionist to do real science. In fact, evolution has nothing to do with real science. Uh, the founders of modern science were Bible-believing Christians like Sir Isaac Newton. Kepler, Faraday, Maxwell. Unfortunately, even though the evidence is very strong for creation, most people don't get to hear it. Not in the newspapers or the government school system. And sadly, even many churches have capitulated to evolution. And there's no need for this. And so uh, my aim is to try to show people in the church and outside the church that evolution doesn't make any sense, that we can believe in creation and we can trust the Bible right from its beginning.